Okay, so this is a brown recluse that I'm willingly putting on my hand because I know what I'm doing. It's not your typical hitchhiker. This is like the farthest that a brown mm. recluse can go in North America, and it did it. But it's here now. A woman named Amy Mayfield was moving her mother up to Alaska from Kansas. When they arrived, she noticed the spider had stowed away inside a family painting. And it was packed up in a, in a connex at mid-July and unpacked in Palmer at the end of August, so a full month had, had lapsed and she drove in a U-Haul up here. Keith Burgess runs the local Facebook page Spiders of Alaska. He, along with UAF professor of entomology Derek Sykes, says it's the first confirmed case of a brown recluse hitching a ride to Alaska. There's stories, but has never been confirmed. They've always been something else, um, misidentifications. Um, this one is the first one. It is so far from its natural habitat that it is absurd. But it's found a new home with Burgess. So now I've got a new friend. I actually had a contest over the weekend for naming him, and the winning name is Stowaway Steve. <laughs> Stowaway Steve now joining Burgess's collection of other non-Alaskan spiders he keeps contained in his home. Latrodectus mactens, southern black widow. This is my most beautiful spider a Loxosceles simulima. I'll gladly take it in. Um, my, my spider adventures started years ago with one jumping spider and it turned into me <laughs> housing brown recluse and black widows. <laughs> but just because this one made it all the way up here doesn't mean it has its run of the land as it can't survive here in the wild. If I were to just like let one out here, it will be dead very, very fast. Um, the climate's totally different. I, I mean, it, we have similar temperatures is where they're found, but it's the climate. It's different. We've got harsher nights. We've got, you know, uh, frost sometimes. The, the insects that we have are a lot smaller. They don't have a good food supply. Um, and they're just not built for this. Steve, go back home. Let's cook some back in this house. He's probably really cold. <laughs> 